Hey guys, I'm Pistol 101 and welcome back to Dying Like the Following. This is part two. So I did the little race. I didn't want to show you guys the whole thing. I got plenty of time. And I got to the valve where we have to shut off the water supply. Oh, okay, I'm tapping A. We're good. Okay, so I went ahead and did that race. So you, you guys didn't have to watch that again. There was no point. I just went ahead and got here. You know, that seemed smarter than just, you know, doing that whole driving thing. Save some time, make it go a little bit faster. So I'm gonna let you guys in on a little secret, all right? I recorded for about 10 minutes, right? And I had too much running on my computer at the same time. I have like 16 gigabytes of RAM, but I had too much running and my computer crashed and I lost my capture, which is probably like the first time that's happened, I think. And so what I did, so I, cause I'm so committed to you guys and wanted to show you guys everything that's happening. I restarted the following. I restarted the expansion and played all the way back up to this point. However, it saved my, uh, like, progression and stats. So I guess I have a little bit higher stats and stuff, and it saves my inventory. But I had to play all of that through again. So this is my second time through. But, uh, we're not- I wasn't that far ahead of this location. I was only, like, ten minutes. Ali, I got it. But, yeah. Flooding, You're so welcome, you bitches. I hate you all. I love you. Yes. Now it should just be a matter of time. So we're- Oh, oh, okay. I'm gonna let him finish talking. <laughs> You're all right. you know. Yeah, I'm all right. Okay, cool. Press X while the damage part is highlighted to repair it. So I found out a few things about this, okay? I found out that you actually have to have upkeep on your freaking, uh, your vehicle, right? So you actually have to have all these things to where you repair your, uh, your vehicle, okay? And you have to complete, like, you have to put gas in it. Wait, hold on. What is this? Okay, I can't upgrade condition 29% repairs left three. How do I repair it? You're missing some component screws. Okay, so you actually have to loot other cars and things right here for the gas if it's empty. And in the front, and it gives you different parts. And you actually have to keep, you have to like upkeep your freaking buggy. So that's going to be a whole chore. It's going to be a whole thing that we're going to have to do. Okay, it looks like all the gas is out of this one. See, like, there's some screws. So you actually have to go to these separate cars and do this, and we're going to have to upkeep with that the whole time. I mean, I would do something like that if it lasted long enough, like, between parts. But, I mean, we're going to have to upkeep it some in the middle of a play, a playthrough of a recording. So that's what it is. Sorry, guys. I don't know what to tell you. That's it. I go home. But, yeah, I didn't even notice the fuel meter right there at the bottom. I should have in the last part, but I didn't because I'm dumb. And I was, pay I was paying attention to other things. But, yes, apparently we can waste fuel. And I believe when I asked you guys in the last part, if you haven't watched it, go watch it. Why are you watching part two? That's dumb. Watch part one, then part two. Uh, I wondered what those things to the left were. Of uh, like You see the fuel meter, right, on the bottom right. And then that other meter on the left, it looks like that's like how well my parts are. Like, whether they need to be healed or not. Because I was wondering why they were flashing red, and I asked you guys to tell me. None of you did, but I found that out on my own. So, haha. -ha. I guess we'll just park this here. Okay. So, another thing about this. After this, it's going to ask us to do a bunch of side quests to build trust. So that we can unlock the main quest, I'm assuming is what it is. The main quest for, uh, for this, I guess, area. So, what I plan on doing is, for now, I'll, I'll tell you after I'm done talking to him, okay? Here we go. Our wells have been polluted for the last <clears throat> month, and people were getting sicker and sicker. Maybe I was wrong about you, stranger. Yeah, maybe. So, nice hat, nerd. Any chance you'll answer my question now? About that medicine? I like how he I ran out of pockets, so he made one as a necklace so he can put stuff in it. You dumb idiot, just here. So, you have this notice board over here, and there's gonna have all kinds of, like, a quest we can do. What I'm going to do is I'm gonna start... I'm going to actually do all these quests, these side quests as they are, kind of. But they pertain to the main story in that you have to do them to progress the main story. However, in the future, when there's more of them, because I'm sure there will be. If I feel like we're going too slow with this playthrough, like not enough's getting done, we need to move faster. I will just do all the side quests off screen and I will do the main quest stories. However, I don't think that will be too much of a problem. You guys let me know what you want to see in the comments. And but if you don't see, tell me, I'm just going to do what I want. We're running out of Antison. I'm looking for anything that could save my friends. If you have anything... Yes, stranger, we do. We have our faith and our prayers to the mother. We have faith. our prayers to the mother. My mother or your mother? I'm still confused I, I, about I that. I mean no disrespect, but you, you're telling me that prayers keep you from turning? That's He's not problem. having it. Crane is not you having it. Faith, just like the other outsiders. We believe in the mother, and she protects us. 
We have no need of Antonson. You spelled it wrong, you idiot. Said. Okay. You don't even know what it's called. Okay, well, is there any way I could maybe speak with this mother? You're an ignorant she is fuck. Sacred. I don't like she you. Only I never trusted you. As the faceless. But maybe, maybe you could get them to notice you. If you do enough good for our community. At this point, I'll take anything. So what kind of good are you looking for? What, what needs to be done around here? You're serious about this. <laughs> All right, then. Me, Sorry about my throat, guys. I may have to clear it some through this playthrough, but I'll he try to turn away from the mic when I do it. Safe. Look around. You'll find more work than any one man could handle. All right. So you go ahead and tell me that. So level of trust. The only way to discover the secrets of the children of the sun is to earn the acceptance of the faceless. The mother's most devoted protectors. Complete quests, help people you meet in the wild, secure safe zones, etc. To raise your level of trust. All right. And as you can see, the trust rank is over here. We are now as a outsider, I guess, or whatever. And then I, this one's like stranger. And you have all these levels of trust. I don't know how far we need to get. But once it lets me do the main quest, I'll do them. So I'm just going to do it up to that point. And then if there's any more I need to do... I mean, I guess I won't do that, or I'll do it off screen if I do any of them. But again, for now, we're gonna actually do all these side quests, okay? And if it, if I feel it's taking too long and there's just 20 billion in the future, we won't do them. But for now, we're gonna do them, so strap in. This may take a while. People, we just got wind of... I'm just gonna let you guys pause it and read that if you want. I'm not gonna read it. When we get to the locations, they'll probably talk to us and tell us all about it. Volatile hives. Hives are volatile breeding grounds, and the countryside is littered with them. If you destroy them, you'll decrease the volatile population and make the nights safer both for you and yourself and the locals. Beware, though, hives are full of volatiles during the day, so your best chance of succeeding is to attack them at night. Missing person. Brothers and sisters. Yeah, I'm not reading all that, see? So, if I go to those locations, they'll probably tell me a little bit about the story without me having to read it. But you guys can pause it if you really want to read that stuff. Okay. So, we have all these quests. I saw... Didn't she have, didn't you have an exclamation point over your head earlier? Okay, let's check it. Let's take a, take a look at our quest here. Quest. See, these are all side quests, but you have to do them because the main quest says try to help the locals. Again, I only played up to this point. Uh, last time, again, when I lost my last capture, I just drove to the mechanic's place and I talked to him for a minute. And in the middle of our conversation, everything crashed. So that's as far as I've played. If you're wondering how far I've gotten, it's about to be nighttime. And if you're not familiar with this game during the nighttime, uh, a lot of baddies come out and do bad things for bad reasons. They, I actually went out at night, and I was actually going to show you guys. It was so cool before my last capture crashed. I mean, we're gonna like, we're gonna label this as like the the, the capture crash of 2016. You know, never forget, rip in peace. What happened? No one knows. But uh, yeah, those things chased after my car at the speed of my car. I'm fine. Don't worry. But listen, your patient was right. There's this, there's this group here, and all of its members seem to be immune to the virus. Immune? How is that possible? I don't know. They're protected by some local shaman type called the Please mother. let us get there before and nighttime, please. Please. Priests. Please. I'll try to get in touch with them, but these people don't trust outsiders for shit. Keep trying, but be careful. You guys understand, in my last capture, I was like, we're not going to be a bitch. It was nighttime before we left that last compound we just left. And I was like, we're not going to be bitches. I went out, and I didn't make it across the field before those huge monsters threw me out of my freaking car, and I died. It was it was terrible. I, I'm trauma traumatized. I can't handle it. So, because of that, we are uh, we are not... Mm -mm. I may show you once. I mean, we'll, we may try to travel at night one time. But if we want to get through this, like, men, gentlemen, ladies, whatever... We, there's no way. There's no possible way we're going to be able to do this. So, yeah, again, I'm going to have to scavenge for fuel and stuff, guys. Sorry. I apologize. It has to be done. We got to keep our fuel up. We, we also need to find, like, screws and stuff to repair our buggy. But I haven't found as many of those. I'm stocked up a little bit on gasoline, but screws less so. I don't have as many screws. Looks like this guy's a shop. What you selling? Oh, that's out of my budget. What is this, damage? Oh, that damage is insane. 1,300? My stuff does, like, yeah, you as you can see, 1,500, 1,300. That's about the range my stuff's in. But this one does 1,300 unupgraded. It's a premium katana for 26,000. Where is my... I have 17,000 cash. Okay. So, yeah, I'm not going to be able to... Uh, I'm not going to be able to afford any of this stuff for a while, guys. Sorry, I'm low on funds. But my weapons that I have now are pretty awesome. So, I mean, you know, it's what it is. All right, let's go talk to this mechanic and see what he has to say man nice backwards hat 
You're a bro, Steve, I can you, tell. Uh, you you practice brokeism and. Hey, hey, Nori, it's all right, buddy. Here you go. I'm Bilal. Oh, That's is that that kid maybe like okay. mentally handicapped? I guess. Oh, sorry. So what can I do? I don't know how he's gonna survive in the zombie uh, apocalypse mentally handicapped, but okay. I need a hand with a few things. Oh yeah, Josir told me you'd come. I heard all about you. Listen, I, I, I'm just trying to help the people back in the city. Hey, helping me Look, I just need them to tell me to shit, and they told to me, me I had to help you. I, I really don't want to. If I had to get away with not helping I you, I would, but I can't. Two months ago. Wait, two months? And he, and he hasn't turned? Two months. Either, he hasn't but, turned. Hey, there he is, still in working order, unlike this wreck. Just take a look at the board over there. Jasir ain't lying. We could use plenty of help. And man, I'm envious of your ride. It's the only working vehicle. This I've is where it crashed the last time, guys. Tell I'm scared. What, if you bring it back here and let me look inside from time to time, I'll give it some tuning up. Make it even sweeter. You look like you've seen some shit. I mean, you got those like gears in your ear or whatever. You have you the, that tattoo, that scar. I mean, you're crazy. Minute. I'm not exactly a mechanic. Then it's a good thing you're talking to me. Here's what you do. It'll be a long drive. Oh my god. My left hand in oh, a long drive. No. Oh my god. All right, let's play I Spy on the way. And if you find any useful parts, bring them to me. Any useful parts? Yeah, fuck you. I'm ke I'm keeping my parts. Reward, paint job. Wait, what? I want a reward. Oh, sweet. I can paint my buggy different paint jobs. That'll be kind of cool. All right. Yeah, I guess I got to accept all these side quests, I guess. I don't know. There's so many of them. Why? Why are there so many? God, I mean, they're they're really giving you the bang for your buck for this expansion, but in terms of just getting through the story... Fuck. Power must be offline. Hello? We're working on the problem. You want to help us out with it? Sure. Is it... I don't like the power being off. I don't I don't like that. I'm not a... Uh, uh, uh. I don't want I don't want to deal with that. Anyways, yeah, there's a lot of side quests, guys. I I'm a fan of a side quests being optional, but when you have to do side quests, that pisses me off. Hope locals order to get noticed by faceless. Okay, so I guess we just do whichever ones of these. Let's try to do we already did the mechanic one. Destroy the volatile hive. Ask Bleal about the power plant. Investigate the mysterious noises in the park. Find the food stealing creatures seen near the cave at the beach. Get to the Silas truck stranded on a highway. Okay, these are all easy, easy, very easy, very hard. Uh, yeah, let's go with the uh, just easy one first, I guess. Let's see what that's all about. Where There's going to be a lot of driving. I don't think there's too much fast travel on this game, but we'll see how that is. I think maybe if I capture some of these like houses, I can fast travel to them, like their safe zones. But we'll see about doing all that. Again, guys, you better strap in. This is going to be a whole freaking thing. This is going to be a long playthrough. We need to find a bed so we can sleep through the night. If you guys want to say, like, No, nah, don't be a bitch, go out at night. Maybe one time I'll show you guys, but look, it's not happening, alright? Those things, if I could get away from them in my car, I would. But I have not, when I went out there, they chased me as fast as my car could drive. And it was scary. Maybe I'll show you one time, I'll tell you the horror stories. Okay. Hey, little Susie. You're gonna die later, don't tell nobody. Okay, nope, no grappling hook. We gotta jump out of here. My buggy is over here. Alright, let's travel to that side quest. Strange noises. Away! We built this city. Bah, bah, bah. Oh, that's a big army guy. Oh, no, no, not the army guys. Oh, it looks like they have armor of some kind. No, I'm good. I'm fine. So the strange noises should be around here somewhere. We just traveled. You guys missed it. We scaled a cliffside. It was epic. I'm not going to show it all because, I mean, me just traveling in this game will be pointless. We're never going to get anything done if I show me going from every place in this game. So you guys are going to have to, I mean, get over it. There's, If you want to see that, why? Two, uh, there's, I mean, it would just take forever to do anything. There would be no point. We would never get done with this game because like, there's hardly much fast traveling and all that. Investigate the mysterious noises in the park. Yeah, I'm looking, man. This is the park, all right. We got a bench over here. Got a porta potty. Who are, you? Who are you? Do I need to kill all the zombies in the park? What exactly is my objective? Maybe there's a cave somewhere. I don't know. Oh, do we go in this well? Oh, I bet we do. 
Oh, first let me kill the zombies in the park and see if that does anything. No, I didn't think so. I didn't expect it to. All right, time to go in the well, gentlemen, ladies. It's been fun. It's been real. Uh, crouch. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, do you see how I caught myself with that grappling hook? Oh, not again. Not again. No. Damn, where do all these cans come from? Why is it... I don't like that screaming. Please stop it. Please. No. Not again. I'm not I'm not in the mood for that. I don't I don't want that. I don't like it. All kinds of fucked oh, up. oh, no, 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 shh, shh, go to sleep. Oh, this is an enemy from the main game, guys. Hold on. Okay, yes, it's dead. That is an enemy from the main game. And uh it's like a little baby that screams, and I think it attracts other zombies, but if not, it just like incapacitates you for a second. And it's basically like a baby zombie, is what it is. It's pretty horrifying, and I don't like it. That's a lot of food. You guys prepared for the worst, didn't you? Okay, we go down here, it looks like. I don't remember how to sprint in the water. I don't exactly remember. I think, okay, B is how you dive. Uh, I don't know how to go up exactly. Okay, R, R, B is how you go up. I don't know how you sprint, though. Like, I'm pressing what would be the sprint button to swim faster, but I don't know if that actually helps or works. I think my guy can hold his breath pretty much indefinitely. It's pretty crazy. I think, oh, okay, apparently not. When that thing goes down, I think I die. Well, so much for doing that. Oh, well. Yeah, there's a lot of crap in here. This guy, what you got going on? Nothing? Okay, just don't attack me. That would be great. Can I breathe? Please? Yes, okay. Yeah, that's like a stamina bar type thing. Okay, and dive away. Just keep swimming. Boy, howdy, did we just swim forever. Oh my god, guys, I'm not keeping that in, you better believe. Oh, how do I get out of here? Please. Please, let me out, please. Okay, thank you, there's there, there's a top. I didn't want to drown to death, that would, have, that would have not been very pleasant. By the way, if you guys hear this tapping, you hear that noise, it's because I have to press uh, RB to jump, you see? So, if you guys keep hearing tapping, maybe a little bit slightly, a uh, little, little, you know, suppressed in the mic, that's why. It's because I gotta press that to jump, and uh, it's a dumb jump button. A would be a much quieter button to jump, but, you know, whatever. Alright, let's use the ping. We have a ping here to show us where things are. I just don't use it often because I'm dumb. This is a spooky cave, guys. This is really, really spooky, but I don't know. We're supposed to find out why the food is stockpiled, but I'm not finding much out. Let's see what's up here. Nope, nothing. Nothing's up there. Okay. I was hoping to land back in the water. Now I lost my bearings. Hmm, okay. Let's climb back up here. Okay, we came from this way. Let's keep going and see if what we need is this way. I think we just got to keep following this line. I don't think this all loops back in a circle, but we will see. Uh, we're going deep. Deep into the abyss. Oh, yeah, this is real deep. I wonder if the deeper I go, does the pressure make me lose stamina faster? I can't really confirm that. I can't tell. But that would make sense if it did. If not, that's fine. I understand. That would be a whole other mechanic you'd have to add in. But, I, you know, whatever. I'm just thinking out loud here. Thinking of something while I keep swimming through this godforsaken place. Like, seriously, where do I go? There's nothing here. Oh, wait. Entering dark area. Okay, well, I stand corrected. And by the way, guys, you know what that means? That means that place we were in before wasn't dark. Not dark at all. That's, that's bitch dark. This is the real dark. There's no zombie... Oh, I thought that was like a figure. I thought that was a zombie. I was freaked out, but apparently not. That's that's just a rock. <clears throat> Screw me. Okay, looks like we made it to where we need to go. Hey, what's that? No, it's just a light. Okay, looks like we're gonna have to fight some kind of zombie in here. This looks like an arena almost. This little large open area for no reason. I don't know why else it would be there. Hello. Oh. Listen, please. I'm listening, man. What you got? Why are you in a cave? Hey, what's up? Shit. O okay, I'm listening. Nice camo, hey, man. In there. That's my child. Don't don't let him die of hunger. Don't let him suffer. Stranger, please come here as fast as you can. It's important. He's fine. He's uh he's I actually talked to him earlier. He's uh he's fine. He's fine. Don't worry about him. If you, if you see a child-shaped zombie in there, though, and he has uh, Egyptian Kopesh sliced through his left uh, mandib mandible, that, that, that wasn't me. That wasn't me. That was, uh, that was the other guy. 
Who? Doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. Okay, help the locals in order to get noticed by the faceless. Return to Jasir. Okay, well, it looks like we can return to Jasir now. And, oh, oh, hold on. No, okay, we, we almost fell off that rock, but I think we're good now. All right, we need to scale back up this cliff. It says return to Jasir. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh. Oh, I caught myself. Oh, see, guys, this place is dangerous. This is so dangerous. I, I there's You can fall in any time anyway. Anyways, we I think we go back to Jasir now. Is that for the main quest or yes? Yes, my lads. Yes, my boys. Okay, guys. One, two, three. Teleport. Oh, hey. Hey. Hey, hold up. Hold up. In the middle of a teleport, we come across this guy. Oh, man, he spits stuff at me. You're fat. You're fat, stupid. Screw you. Oh, we can use him as camouflage, too. Oh! Oh, dude, this is some Walking Dead shit. Oh, can't see me! Can't see me! All right, let's continue teleporting. Are we there yet? 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 Hey, we're there! We did it! All right, finally made it. Okay, that was a long time, kind of, sort of. You don't know that. So I, I did some things. I stopped by that mechanics place again, accepted a new quest. I didn't start it, I just accepted it. And uh, I, st I stashed some of the weapons I didn't need in my inventory in my stash. I got some parts, repaired my vehicle, got that all done. I changed my outfit to, it's called American. So I just, I'm just like, an, like a star on my face or my shirt and my face is all painted stuff. I'll show you later, maybe. Maybe not, but if it shows my guy in third person, he should be in that outfit. So let's go ahead and talk to Jasir, see what he has to say. Oh, no, the Faceless. We'll talk to you. Okay. What's up, oh, man? So, you're one of the Faceless. Will you let me speak to the mother? You know... You think she would speak with a stranger? No. I don't know but for sure. On the right path if you wish to but I think you have a face behind that mask. What's your name? I can't Aaron. tell. You have a long I bet you do. I'm gonna go with the... Maybe. I'm gonna go with the maybe. And may this help you in your struggle. You're my new best friend. Hello. You give me a crossbow. Oh. You can leave now, newcomer. Oh, I can leave now. That's it. Oh, now I gotta go help some more locals. Fine. Let's go ahead and accept all this stuff. Jazeer. Those bandits who took over Aircon's farm. Aren't you afraid they're gonna target you guys next? Here we can handle them, but we're no soldiers. I won't send people to die out there. Well, your set of skills might come in handy in this situation. Just talk to Eski. She'll explain the kind of scum you'll be dealing with. And maybe try to find Polat, too. He used to work at Aircom's farm. Maybe he'll have something useful to tell you. All right, interesting. Okay, so yeah, I just want to go ahead and accept all of this, and then we can Sarah, ask. do it later. How do you want bolter livers? You know, I really don't okay. care. He wants bolter liver okay. livers. We're not going to sit through that whole conversation. Bolter hunting. The swift footed bolter feels safer. Uh, okay, so apparently you lure him with livers. I don't. I'm not gonna read all that. That's too much, and that has nothing to do with anything. So we're just gonna accept it all. And they're freaks of nature. In some parts of the countryside, you'll find extremely dangerous enemies. True freaks of nature. If you encounter such a monstrosity, be prepared for a huge challenge. Don't try to kill them alone unless you have the knack for finding the weak points of your enemies. I'm sure we're gonna come across one of those in our day, but whatever. Okay. So. It says there's a little exclamation point right here, a little white one. Oh, a strange request. Okay. Let's huh. pick it up. It is here. Who drew this? Oh, that's not important. Man, shout out to that lag, you that keep loading. Throwing them. I keep throwing them away. <laughs> well, but what's it about? Come on, game load. Something the kids hung up. <laughs> it takes so long for him to respond. Like he's stupid. Like he's like him with his grandparents. Oh, yeah, yeah, this is why. <laughs> she was supposed to send him a gift, I guess. But you know what happened. It doesn't matter. Just toss it. Just toss it? Um. I don't know what this... Have any pack? You can bring me a package? I'm not doing that right now. Maybe? Is it timed? So this whole time, the kid's been waiting on a present? Okay, so we have a ton of shenanigans to do. And I will showcase not all, but some of them. Because, I mean... Look at all these side quests, dear God. Oh my God, what even counts as doing something? Ask Exy, okay, well, believers, we ask you to pray. What is all this about? Okay, this is, this is the Lazarus thing. That's an objective. We should probably do that. Power to the people. Find an insulator on the power pole. I think that means that's restoring the power at the mechanic shop. Heart of Darkness, destroy the Volatile Hive. I don't know how much destroying the Volatile Hive does, but it says it's very hard. So I may want to save that for another day, possibly. Reclamation, clear the area. 
Okay, hunt down a bolter and bring it to the liver. For now, we'll probably do Lazarus, where we talk to Ezgi. That's like a good one. So let's go talk to Ezgi. Ezgi. What do you got to say, Ezgi? What you got going on? Hey, Paul, I oh, I don't even think this is the quest. Far. I think I'm going to talk to him, and he's going to give me another suicide. quest or something. Hey, let me be the judge of that. Besides, the bandits might target this place next. Let them fucking try. After what they did to that girl... There won't be no mercy. So there will be mercy. That That's a double negative. Wait. I'm just saying, buddy. Right now? Don't get all high and mighty with me, mister. We are angry, true. But we are not crazy. You want to get yourself killed? I think I can handle some thugs with guns. I heard you might be able to help me. I'm basically a one-man you army. You don't understand. Work there, I I'm more of a one-man army than Laura Croft. Really Seriously. If you guys haven't seen my Laura Croft... Laura Croft, Rise of the Tomb Raider playthrough. Go watch it. It's decent. Wall. I would give it an 8 out of 10. Use it to sneak in. Okay, so that just progressed the going postal thing. But now we're going to go ask Exgi about what we're supposed to be doing here. We'll see what she has to say, and then we will wrap this part up. That will be the end. I am ending it after we talk to her. Exgi. This is not Exgi. Exgi's upstairs. Let's go. We got to talk to her, and then there will be more action next part, because we'll be doing all of these quests, or some of these quests that we've gotten. So a little bit more will be happening. Okay. Okay. Hey, Eski, have you... Oh. That's, uh... That's Erkan's daughter, right? No. That's not her. That's what's left of her. She was the happiest person I'd ever known, but now... I'm sorry, but... She's, uh... Conscious, right? Conscious, yes. Who are we talking about? But the longer she lies there, the more I feel like she just... Oh, the person. There must be a person in bed beside us that I didn't see. When she was still speaking... She told me they hurt her, and her mother. They shot her brother in the face, Kyle. Yeah, shout Never out to watched. Detroit. Okay, happens every day. What do you think, you're special? I'll take care of it. They won't hurt anyone else. Yeah, of course. Sorry. I just think I've heard it too many times. I'm still going to put a magnet under your lip one day. It's going to be funny. Okay, Lazarus. Ask Izzy about the de details. And now we're going to avenge Erkan's... Erkan? I think is her name. Erkan's family. Let's go ahead and go downstairs. Oh, man, we're so fast. Oh, Speedy Gonzalez over here. Okay. Well, guys, we accepted a bunch of quests, did a bunch of things, and I think that about wraps it up for this part. All right. Yep, she's just swinging away. Well, guys, thank you for watching part two of Dying Light the Following. I'm Pistol101. If you like this video, feel free to press the like button. If you want, support me on Patreon. Link's in the description. And subscribe. I'll see you guys later.